Adama Diamond, heading the ball, says a Portland Timbers player called him a racial slur. Chris Carlson Associated Press, LAFC forward Adama Diamond said Thursday in a social media post that he was called the N-word by an unidentified Portland Timbers player during a U.S. Open Cup quarterfinal Wednesday night. Today was the first time in my professional career that I was called the N-word on the field, Adama Diamond, a Norwegian of Ivorian descent, wrote on Instagram. They will say sorry to me after the game and please let it go, but if I don't say anything racism will just continue to grow. No matter which country, color, religion or which language you're speaking we all are human beings and we should respect each other no matter what, number sonotaruses in the player have been reported. Toronto FC suspends supporter group privileges in wake of fire at Ottawa Stadium in response, the Timbers issued a statement to the Oregonian, it's unclear when the incident took place. Diamond entered the game as a substitute in the 68th minute, and Deadspin's Lauren Dyson reported he was involved in a very minor seeming skirmish near the end of the match. Diamond's accusation wasn't the only controversy to arise from the match, which LAFC won, 3-2, ostensibly advancing to the semi-finals. After the game, the Timbers lodged a protest with US Soccer, alleging that LAFC exceeded the allowed number of foreign players in its lineup. Teams playing in the US Open Cup, America's club championship competition, are allowed to field no more than five foreign players, but LAFC seemingly used seven against Portland. The issue seems to revolve around whether Canadians Mark Anthony K and Dejan Chakava count as domestic or international players. They are considered domestic players under MLS rules. Jakovic has a valid U.S. green card, and ESPN reported that LAFC Executive Vice President of Soccer Operations John Thornton asked the USSF before the match whether K counted as a domestic or international player. K seems to be listed as a domestic player in the USSF issued match day roster as a result of the protest, U. S Soccer announced Thursday that the draw for the US Open Cup semifinals had been postponed until the matter could be sorted out. Read more from the post, Danny Amendola will probably never really understand Malcolm Butler's Super Bowl benching fantasy football, the top 30 wide receivers for 2018 NFL training camp 2018 schedule and locations, when does your team report? Olympic figure skating medalist Dennis Ten killed in stabbing, 